Hello everybody, welcome to yet another exciting series of CATSIM Technologies in AutoCAD 2013. In this session we are going to discuss about how to create production drawings of 3D models. Production drawings include sections, plans, elevations in layout for a company to get the work done. Now let's see, we have a 3D model of a component. You can see the 3D model over here. It's a core shell over here with some feature in the surface as you can see. So we'll learn how to create the sections and elevations of this particular model and then produce it in the sheet. Uh, first of all, we go to the plan view. Take the wireframe structure. We have two commands to execute for creating the production drawing. First command is a solve view command and the other is the solve draw command. Solve view command will basically create a solid view of the sections as well as the elevation whatever you require and the draw will sketch the view as per the need. So solve view command enter in the command prompt the layout will be displayed using the layout one as the default layout you have the model space over here you have the model over here so what we require here is to create a sectional view of this component so i take the s for section option it asks Specify first point of cutting plane. So I am interested to get the section from, let's say, I put the ortho on, from this point to this point. The viewing direction would be, I want to view from this point, I click over here. View scale, for instance, I will take 5. The view center, where I want to create the viewport would be this. And then press enter, I will specify my own viewport. The name is S1, press enter. So I've created a section view with the name S1 and I will draw this section view in the layout. To escape the command, double enter. Now I will come into the paper space, I'm in the models, I was in the model space, adjust the viewport to accommodate the new view. So go for the MS command, zoom all to see the generated view okay come to the paper space again type the salt draw command select the viewport press enter and then you can see the section view is generated you have the hatches over here go to the paper model space select the hatches let's say i select the hatch here and I'll increase the scale from 1 to 10 let's say let's say I increase the scale to 2 I'll take the section as this let's say I make it as 15 right So you can see the section is generated in the model space I go for zoom all paper space I zoom out and I can see the now if you check the layer there are dimension layer hatching layer hidden layer and visual layers created for the view now go to the model space again check this zoom all this is the model and I put the regenerate command and this is the section I go to the paper space now I can use the dimension commands and start going for the production drawings so this was a session for creating solid draw from the solve view now let's see if you want to create more views like I want to create the front view of this model come to the model space click this go for the solve view command 
I'll take the ortho option. That means orthographic projection. I want. I'm interested to look the model from this view. The view center. I'll put it somewhere here, and the viewport would be this. The name is F1. Press enter. Come to the exit the command. Come to the paper space. Again, you know you need to resize the viewport. Come to the model space MS. Zoom all. You can see the view over here. So now here you have generated the view. Now you are going to draw this. Solve draw. Select the object. Now you can see the front view of the object is created. You can you have different layers of this. Again, let's say for the F1 visual lines, I want to give a different color. It will appear on the screen. For the hidden lines, I want to give a different color and a different line type, obviously because it is hidden, and so on. You can see it is generated. Hope you have enjoyed this video on Solve View and Solve Draw in AutoCAD 2013. Thank you.